Hi guys, Englishman here. Number five, Master Junction. We're here. Santa Lucia uh, roundabout tunnels. The safer access to Santa Lucia and Pola and Tarshin. This is how it's going to look. This big island, they're going to dig down into it. This is number five, as I said. Stay to the end because I'm going right down into Marsa. I'm going to show you the flyovers. Uh, right under the flyovers. We're going to see if we can get into the tunnel, but they've done a very good job lately. You know, before the videos, it was quite open down there in Marsa. Here they've got some signs. Um, I don't like breaking the, the... It's not really look like a law, it just says uh, nobody beyond this point, so there's big flats here. Normally I don't give a damn, but uh, lots of people like to... Uh... Hey, let's go across here quickly. This is heading... This is going to be the road going to the tunnel. The tunnel, the way they're constructing the tunnel in Malta, they're obviously building a very big trench and then they're putting these blocks on top of it. Obviously it's still going to be a tunnel. But uh, there was an island over here. It was quite a busy island. So obviously that's to, just to keep the flow of traffic. This is the start of it here. I think we can't go past this uh, Santa Lucia here. There's a lovely garden if you get a chance. If you're over here, there's a Chinese garden. Beautiful uh, from the Chinese government. At one stage it wasn't being looked after, but it's not so bad now. I've got a video of it. Here we are, guys. This is going to be the start of the tunnel. Danger! Stay out, no authorised, no unauthorised person. Uh, but there's not much to see. I'm sure I'm going to pick up a bit as I'm going down to Marsa. I'm going to go all the way down to Marsa, stay to the end. Uh, it looks really impressive. There's about another three more flyovers. I'm going right down that new road. Uh, let's go anyway. It's quite a decent walk. Uh, we'll go past it, we'll follow all the way down, and we'll see that how that farm, there was a, a little farm that, on the way down there. Uh, he was going to have his land like cut in half, so be interested to see how he's doing. We'll have a look at the flyover, uh, we'll have a look at the island, how far they've got, and we'll see the uh, flyovers in Marsa. Follow me, guys. Going down to Marsa, we're gonna go. We're gonna go down to Marsa. We're gonna see what they're gonna do down here. And here is the start of the tunnels. Uh, Santa Lucia coming up from the south, going all the way down to Marsa Junction. So follow me to the end. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna see what we can see. We obviously we don't want to get into. They put a lot of signs up now, so danger and private. So um, we just try and take a little bit. This is the Sunday evening traffic. Uh, everybody coming back, everybody going out at the moment. Uh, seems the traffic is very, very busy. Obviously they've been out for the day, so let's walk down. See what we can see, this is the road, the new road they're gonna start all the way from the uh, Tashin end, Santa Lucia. The whole area has been redone. We're gonna walk all the way down to Marsa. Come on, follow me, let's see what we find. Yes. My island in the sun This is the start of the tunnel going down underneath. 
he really did a good job. He's very hard to get in. Uh, even though I don't want to get into private property, but uh, there is a lot of signs up saying uh, danger. But here it drops down. We might get a better view if we just uh, walk down a little bit more. You can see this is the start of the, going to be covered over, I think, from where we started. Uh, all the way to Marsa. Come on, let's see if we can find any, a little bit of a better view than there. Everywhere fenced off though. Uh, obviously there is a bit of danger here. Then maybe that's the reason why. Let's keep walking, guys. You can see this is Santa Lucia Island. Coming up where we were down there. And at this point here, it's gonna go into tunnels. We're gonna keep walking down towards Massa. There's a lot of signs, no, un no unauthorized people, so, and there's a lot of people around, so better I don't go into these places. Um, well, actually, there's not a lot to see, I think. It's mostly construction here. That road that's coming along, they're gonna cover it over, I think. I think it starts dropping down there. I'm gonna walk across here, see if we can see anything. Because this road is partly blocked off halfway down, so... Uh, maybe we see something, guys. You can see they're gonna continue on. I'm not sure what they're gonna do here. It's like as if they're gonna... Still digging that away. Look how busy it is, guys. All these people coming from the beach. This is the uh, gonna be the tunnel here. Oh, this is re, uh, redirected traffic. They're gonna bend them round to come back up again. We we'll continue on down towards Massa. This is quite interesting. I'm not sure what they're gonna do here. Let's go to Massa, guys. Quite a lot of traffic. I was uh, about five minutes trying to cross the road here. You can see right down here is the Massa, Massa Junction. Santa Lucia, this direction. I think that would have been better on the other side of the street. I wonder how you get over there. What we do is maybe we go down to Mars and we come up when we get in the car, because I left the car in Santa Lucia. Uh, what I'll do is I'll, maybe I'll walk on that side of the road. Looks a little bit better, you're a little bit closer, and you haven't got this much traffic. I'm gonna walk down here, guys. Keep walking, see how far I can get without being blocked. <laughs> Seems like it's... Uh... I, last time I walked right along from Marsa, right up to here. Seems that I've been a uh, little bit conscious now about safety. Last time was uh, wide open. I think it's blocked anyway. Let's see, what's, let's see what we can do. <laughs> let's be a bit cheeky. This is where the tunnel's gonna come out. The tunnel going to go underneath the island, then continue down to Massa. It's going to be a beautiful road. There's the tunnel coming on. Completely open. Now this is almost ready. They're just doing the side wall. This wall have had a problem for a, a long time. You know we have a big problem with the Maltese stone, limestone. Just look at the state of it. I'm not sure if they're gonna, uh, they look like they're marking, they're gonna try and do it up. So the tunnel comes from over there, Santa Lucia underneath, and this is the road going all the way down to Marsa. Let's see if we get blocked a bit further down here. There's the, uh, one of the biggest cemeteries in Malta.
We're on our way down to Master, guys. Let's see what they've done with the flyover, see if there's anything new since we've been here. This is number five. Hope you're enjoying it. Uh, we're going to be the first ones on the road. This is almost finished here. There's a small farm here on the left hand side. That'll be quite interesting to see what they've done with it. Cars seem to have their load in here. I think this, this one's ready, but this one is still uh, need a bit of tarmac. I was going to guys, I was going to go into that tunnel because some of the, some of the, there is some gaps. Um, but there's a big flats there and there's a lot of blabbers around. Uh, so I thought I, you could go in and it's not dangerous. And uh, I showed you, I showed you most of it. You know, because if you go through and it says, I go into places when it says it doesn't have any signs. So if it has a door that's open, you can go in, eh? But these were quite big signs, no one beyond this point can still get in, but, uh, oh, all right. Yeah. I don't know, somebody that knows me, I think. <laughs> Beautiful walk down here though, till the cars come. Beautiful countryside, look at this valley here. There's a lot of lovely trees, olive trees, a uh, biter to shauk. Look at this biter here, guys. This is like a little farm here. Uh, you wouldn't notice it. The farm, you wouldn't notice it because you're on this. This should be a road here before. It's not a brand new road. They've just widened it and, uh, and put the tunnel to go underneath the island. And I'm not sure what they're doing that island for, that tunnel, because it wasn't ever that busy. Uh, perhaps it just to keep the flow of the traffic going. What a beautiful evening, guys. Today I did the live. It's uh, Sunday. I picked Sunday because there wouldn't be a lot of traffic, but <laughs> that road was completely blocked going down there. Uh, they're taking it. It seems like um, things are getting relaxed, even in UK. So uh, fingers crossed, people can do their dream and come over. A um, lot of people on live say, oh, Steve, we're missing Malta. We want to come over. I do a live on Sunday, guys, just to uh, a bit of a reminder. 1300 hours. I give a, uh, we have a bit of fun. I do a, a little bit of a free giveaway. I know a biro or a magnet or something like that. Something to chat about, eh? As, a, as I said, though, I was going into the tunnels a bit up the top there. But um, there's a lot of people looking over the top of you. It's like four or five stories. So, you know, if somebody blabs on you, it's not worth it really. Eh? Not worth the trouble if someone comes out. Especially if there's a sign saying, don't go beyond this point. I'm a Lord abiding citizen, so... <laughs> oh, they seem like they're doing a lot of the walls here. Shooting up the walls. Like you can hear the Kokodulu, small farm here on the left-hand side. I'm not sure where they're going to left it. They're going to be very close to him. Seems if they stole some of his land. It's very close to opening. Just this wall, I think, has caused them some problems. Looks like they've some of it, they're shoring it up at the bottom. They're putting some concrete. Uh, here is brand new wall. Really, I would have thought that would have been the best thing to do. But maybe they're, maybe they, uh, it seems like they're putting like a, a shell on the outside. We're gonna put it all the way up. I'll tell you this farm guys, a little bit. It's really nice in the countryside. Beautiful trees going around here. Here was um, a valley for the water. You can see uh, there was like a, a creek or a dam, you would call it here. I showed it before in the videos. I think we can walk this way. Ah, oh, here's the small farm. I don't know what, I don't know what this place was here. This is for um, storm water, <laughs> but you can see there's a lot of ducks in it there. Mostly for storm water to uh, off the valley there coming down. <laughs> hey guys, what we're going to do is walk a bit further down. I'll click it on then. I don't want to. Uh... Oh, Mr. Big. <laughs> Listen, I had a few uh, 
well, a few, maybe one or two complaints that the camera is moving too fast. I try and be slowly, but you know, like when you're walking and talking, and this one, I told you about the Sony without the tripod on the top, it's in my hand, in the palm of my hand. So I'm doing my best for you guys. Sorry if it's a bit jerky sometimes, and maybe it's a bit, when I talk, I like to look into the camera. I hate uh, when people do these things and they talk behind. So if, the, if people think it's uh, too fast, if you think I'm moving the camera too fast, tell me. We'll try and slow things down. This time I did try. Oh, look. I get excited. I want to show you things, guys. And then, uh... oh, there's a lovely chickens here. Small, small farm. He's got hens and chickens. He's really been blocked in, though, here. He had a, he had an entrance, so I don't know how he's going to get in. Oh, from here, maybe. He's, they've given him, like, a driveway to come down. He's got chickens and hens. I think I saw some goats last time I was here. They really gets to sort out here. Oh, I don't really like to see this. Oh, there's too many birds in that cage. Oh, Jesus, that I don't like. He's got so much space. Why is he packing everything in there? I don't like to see that. It's a bit, uh, a bit too much. Coming to the fly over here, I'm not going to go over it, I think. I think that might be pushing it a bit too much. Here's that cemetery we went. It's a beautiful cemetery there. You must go and see it. It's not morbid. There's so much artwork there. It's unbelievable. Beautiful church inside. Well, this is the other flyover coming from Santa Lucia. There's the flyover behind us, guys. I'm not going any further. Uh, it goes into the other one, so it would be difficult to get back. We're going to carry on down now into Marsa. But the sun is right in front of us. I think it would be pushing a bit to go over. And though it's safe, oh, they're knocking this place down. It's been here for a long time. Completely safe here. There's nothing... Uh... There's no cars, no nothing. That's the flyover going off to the airport. This is a beautiful cemetery. Aldorata. Some words, you know, so difficult for me. I don't like with the camera, you know, when they said it's a bit jerky, because uh, I like to get flowing. Um, I don't like to uh, stop uh, and, and put those sort of... Uh, those things in between then you lose the sort of flow um, I like to talk as I'm going along show you things that, that guy I bought a car off him a long time ago this is not my area though I don't really go this area a lot these are the stabilizers for the for the tunnels I think So Santa Lucia flyover is coming uh, here, along, then it goes up to the tunnel. Santa Lucia just on the top of the hill there. Then we go under the tunnel and we go, uh, what's that road called? Ba Barina Barahana Road, I think it is, something like that. It's, uh, it's got a weird name. That goes all the way down uh, to the south of the island. of that building you know these places have been here uh, everybody's complaining about multi-story places but these have been here a long time about I bet it's been over oh, 30 years they've been here probably they were Malta's first high-rise here's the flyover here that we've just been looking at from this side
Jesus, it's raining. You can see the water flowing down here. This is another flyover coming here. Sort of a feeder, no? I think. Feeder going into the side. Uh, into the, we're almost in Marsa now. There's the flower that's connecting to this other one here. Oh, this is going to be another flower, I would imagine, here. So it would be quite interesting to see. There it is, look, Mars uh, Junction project. Oh, eight flyovers, I think it is, something like that. And there's some subways here to go under. It really did an awesome project here. Uh, it's been a terrible problem for many, many years. This, uh, I think I remember somebody said to me there was just one traffic light in Massa. And this is like the connection between the north and the south. So you can imagine it's got a, a lot of flow of traffic and cars increasing every day. There's the fly over there. There's one going off to the motorway, to the uh, airport. Oh, I can see something flapping, what's that? Oh, what a beautiful sunset coming up. Lovely big diggers here, eh? They have a big problem here because there's a lot of... Uh, you can see the ground, it's all... all over the place here. Look at this uh, cemetery. Artwork in that place is fantastic. I think this is one of the entrances to get to it here. Look at it, Gothic style. At the beginning, as soon as you walk into it, guys, you'll be like, wow, this is a cemetery. It's a very old cemetery. The oldest cemetery in Malta and some very famous people buried there. Oh, look at this, lovely here. What I'm going to do, guys, go back up that road up to Santa Lucia on the side, see if we can get a better look at the tunnel. Um, I'm not sure, because on that side of the road it might be slightly better. We haven't finished it yet, so that's number six, I would imagine. Five, six, I can't show you the other one. Look at the countryside here, though. Wouldn't imagine Marsa, the beautiful countryside. Okay, let's go back up, guys. Let's go and have a look at Santa Lucia, see if we can see the tunnel. We're still on the way up, guys. Quiet. You don't realise how steep it is. We're down in Marsa there. Lovely sunset coming down. We're on the way up. Let's see, we're almost up to the tunnels here. It's tiring. I have to navigate a lot of uh, gaps. No, I think where things of this one here is like as if it's all fallen in. So obviously they're digging and they find these problems. Uh, this is the wall here I was showing you. They have to stabilize. They stabilized it with uh, concrete here. Uh, it looks like they're going to leave the wall there, the uh, limestone, and they're putting a skin on the on the a concrete skin on it. A little bit lower, it's okay, but here it's uh, maybe five or six. It's got to be about. It's got to be about three or four meters high, in places. <laughs> I'm tired, guys. <laughs> It's surprising how steep it is, walking, walking down and walking back up. 
I love this oh guys, just a gentle breeze. The live was good. Hey, I had a good time with the live. And somebody won a, he, he decided to win a biro. I don't know which one. I've got some new nice ones. Eh? I mean, these biros are not just normal biros. They're really sought after all over Malta. In excess of one euro. I mean, what a prize. Hey, let's keep going up. I'm hoping, I'm not sure. I'm hoping I'm gonna get a better uh, look of the tunnels from this side. But it looks like I'm being pushed out this way. Back soon, guys. I just noticed this, this is really interesting here. Look, this is these old sort of, no entry. I don't know what that means, why? No tunnel? Not a residence, I'm a resident. That'd be interesting to look in there. Residence. Mm. <laughs> Keep my eyes on the road. <laughs> Let's have a look here. <laughs> Let's have a look under here. It's interesting, this was the old tunnel, I think. We're going underneath the road. Hey, the things you spot when you're walking along. They were, I'm gonna show you when we get out, they were like very old. Oh, here's, a, here's a road here. Residence, residence, the dead ones. <laughs> Around the other side of the road now. I, I wonder where this leads to. Oh, it goes way, way up to there. Bite it to show, guys. Through the tunnel again, because I want to be on that side. But this is really interesting. Look at this, it's uh, a very old tunnel. It was there from ancient time, I would imagine, because I'm going to show you from outside. They've stabilized it, but you know, like uh, these old tunnels with the archways. Hey, we keep the camera running. It doesn't really matter, does it? This is the new part and the old part. Let's go up. I'm going to show you these sort of very ancient archways. It's up, uh, oh, like on the other side he goes. Oh, look how, how all these places are here. A bit further up, guys. We're right on top of the wall. Some trees blocking us here. This looks quite stable, this wall. I'm not sure if they're going to do anything with this. Our task is to see if we can see any more of the tunnels. These were beautiful. Imagine before the road came, the countryside here, all the way to the cemetery. Some magnificent countryside there. Small uh, hamlets. Uh, I noticed some little chapels over the back there. These I noticed, I don't know what they were. There's a lot of them. Either they were stabilizing the wall, they were giving it sort of strength. We're almost up to the tunnel here. I'm not sure how we're going to get on. Uh, seems blocked again. Maybe we'll get a better view from the top. <laughs> Here's the tunnel, guys. And there's a gap between me, there's a big wall, and there's a fence, and there's another fence. Will we ever see this tunnel, guys? That's what I'm going to ask myself. Let's, uh, there's a big mound of earth here. I don't know if we're going to get up it. There's the tunnel, guys, down there. It's all fenced off at the top here. We're not going to get a view of it, I think. <laughs> down here. Look at this shot here. 
Maybe this camera is not picking it up very good. The church in the sun, eh? Sony is not great at these sort of full sun shots. Need a filter, really. That's awesome, though. right on top of this wall guys let's see if we can get a bit closer <laughs> bye old guys look at this villa this is really old eh? Dude, beautiful architecture balustrades it's quite old this one old windows just sitting here on the top of the tunnel let's keep walking around guys start of the tunnel guys that's the best we can do because there's a road in between us sun's going down we can't see we can't go into this side because it's uh, restricted access but it goes down and they're still going to do the middle part under the roundabout let's leave it there guys thanks for joining me master junction number five hope you enjoyed it uh, we went around a bit Sadly, we couldn't get in here, but look at those flats looking over me. Uh, anyway, I did my best. See you guys. Oh, <laughs> don't forget to subscribe. Come and see me on live 1300 hours on Sunday. Videos mostly on Tuesdays, uh, on Thursdays and on Saturdays and on Sunday live. Bye guys. Thanks for joining me. Great support you guys. I love to see your comments. Thumbs up and share. show you all the signs so please subscribe to my channel and give me lots of likes